G'day, I'm Alistair Christie from LearnDelphi.tv and in this video I want to talk about the IDE theming, uh, in particular the new dark theme that's available in Tokyo. Uh, I'm quite a fan of this, I'm using it in my day-to-day -day, uh, programming. Uh, and if we just load up a project, um, I'm not using this machine for, for my day-to-day -day development, um, but uh, I have a, have a desktop, which is uh, significantly gruntier. Um, there should be a button here, which is vanished on my laptop, that allows you to change the theme to a little, little moon, uh, crescent moon, as a little drop down, uh, where you can change to, to the, the light and dark. Uh, but for some reason, uh, it's gone, and I can't find it in the list of commands here to, to put it back. Um, you can, however, go in Tools Options and go and find the Theme Manager. And we see uh, it's set to, to Dark, with the uh, Object Inspector set to Dark, and uh, the editor colors and syntax highlighting uh, charcoal. If we go to light, it's default default and go OK and it should minimize and come back. Um, although I don't think this has been updated, um, but that's OK. We could change that to Classic, I don't know. No. Uh, we could set it to dark and see what happens. So yeah, that is set to dark. So there might be a little bit of a bug there. But if we go to our dark theme, uh, set it to charcoal and dark, um, there's also a custom option. And I've set the uh, IDE theme, or the VCL style, to Ruby Graphite. Um, so charcoal for the uh, source code and dark for the object inspector. And there we have it. So you can see that uh, it looks quite different. Um, doesn't look quite right, but that's okay. Uh, there are plenty of uh, you know themes to play around with, uh, the um, uh, VCL styles. Um, let's go back to dark. So um, in terms of the colours, I, I find these a little bit subdued. Uh, in my uh, sort of Berlin, I have uh, slightly brighter uh, colours for the syntax highlighting. Uh, to make things clearer, um, but this is uh, pretty reasonable. I find the, the, the differences in colors between the numbers here and the, the text um, hardly discernible. The um, theming is not complete uh, either, it's pretty pretty good, like if I do an extract method here, uh, we've, still, we've still got the uh, unthemed uh, control, the, the, the bit in here is themed, um, but not the uh, rest of the dialogue. I think that might be related to the fact that it's uh, um, a, a .NET um, control. And likewise with the, uh, if I do control D to reformat the code. Um, that's pretty much all I wanted to say. Um, the new, new theme, um, I'm using it uh, in my day-to-day -day programming uh, and finding it quite good. Um, it's, it's definitely worth trying. It's easier on the eyes for um, programming uh, for long stretches. So uh, in that respect, it's, it's uh, definitely worth um, giving it a go. So um, I'm Alistair Christie from LearnDelphi.tv. Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next video.